Okay, I bet you didn't know you could get nine thousand dollars from the government to pay funeral expenses. Man, they're getting so expensive, are they? <laughs> but actually, that is from FEMA. So if you have a relative or friend or whatever who died because of COVID, uh, they're giving up the nine thousand dollars, and the program doesn't close until September thirtieth, twenty twenty five. But if it's not from COVID, okay, here's where you got to look. You got to go to findhelp.org. And this is a place to find local organizations. Now, I went to my <laughs> zip code. You put in your zip code, put my zip code in there. And there were 33 nonprofit organizations there located in my zip code that helped me with funeral expenses. Okay, then I tried another one. I put uh, Galveston, Texas or Texas City. And that zip code is 77590. And I found, listen to this. 34 <laughs> sources of free and financial help. But you can't stop there, too, because then you could also use findhelp.org and put in financial assistance in your zip code, and you'll see 285 more sources, not for funerals, but for anything. So this is anything. So try that, too. <laughs> but you have to get on the phone and start calling. That's the way you get it. You call them, hey, do you have this? No, then where can I go? Well, we have a lot of members who have trouble <laughs> trying to get things they need off the internet. <laughs> it is. It can be really. I mean, there are grants that are easy and you just fill out the form or whatever. Then there's others that require more work. And and then also, if you're not used to you know, doing a lot of research uh, online, then that may be a handicap too. And that's why we provide personal help, but we can't do face-to-face -face and fill out applications for you or, or whatever. So we do it, you know, on, on leaving messages is the face-to-face, -face, I mean, is that one-on-one -on -one help we do. But if you need face-to-face, -face, I, I put uh, together seven offices in your area that give you free face-to-face -face help for getting government grants when the internet doesn't do it for you. <laughs> and actually more people should think about, it. even if you're an internet ace, you have to start using people more. So this is good that you don't know uh, that much about the internet and you need face to face because what we have to do is start moving back to there again, because that's where you get the real stuff. So let me go through this list uh, that these are programs. You know, I mean, see, I, I can't afford to do this. We only charge $20. I used to do this when I charged $5,000. Yeah. But the government can't. So the government has all these offices here to give you one-on-one, -on -one, face to face help uh, with your financial problems, whether it's grants, whether it's help, or whatever. Yeah. And to help you think through that. Okay, now here's the first one. And this is really uh, part of HUD. HUD sponsors a program that's been a long, a long, around for a long time, and it's financial counseling. Now, these counselors help with buying a house. They help with credit. And now you want to improve your credit. You want to fix up your credit, whatever, all that kind of stuff. Don't hire a, a company to do that. These people do it for free. Uh, they help with your debt problems, all this stuff. So it's a great place to start uh, to do that. Uh, and then the link here is how to find it. So you don't have to be a member. I'm giving this to the general public because I think it's needed more than anything. So this is everybody could use this. Uh, this is a free report. And so you just look in this, click on here, find your city, find the state and find all the places there that give this kind of help for free. Call up and make an appointment. OK, here's the second one. Department of Agriculture. Man. Department of Agriculture? Yes, Department of Agriculture. They have something called Money Masters Program. Now, these are people that the government trains to help you. They're in every county, whether you're in the rural area or city area, they're all over. So it doesn't matter where you are. And they're part of the County Cooperative Extension Program. I have a link here that shows you a sample of what's in New York. Uh, uh, and and their program. Actually, there's a program I found that even pay you money to come in and get the advice because they're trying to get people to help them. <laughs> they have to pay you to give you free help. Now, that, that's crazy, but that's the government. Uh, who knows what they have? And now what's cool about this, what I've done here, is give you a complete list of every state. So no matter where you are, you could download this list, and then that goes to this report, whereas it shows a state-by-state -state listing of all the free consultants, not only for money, but for anything, you know, uh, in your in your uh, state where you live. So you find the local one in the county. 
So that's a goal of mine. Well, I'm biased, so don't trust me there. <laughs> so what you're looking for is the county cooperative extension and the money master's program. Free. They help you one-on-one. -on -one, sit down. Let's see where you're at, Mr. Lesko. Oh, you're now big heap of trouble, aren't you there? <laughs> and that, so that, that's the second one. Okay. Now here's one too. It's a career one stop. Now that's really for jobs, but that's okay. Because you want to earn money, maybe pool time, part time. You want to get a better job to fix your financial services and they train you for free and everything. Now there's a great organization, but plus besides, you know, if you have money problems, they help with that too. Because most of these have local programs that give you money to live on while you're starting a job or trying to get a job or or need car fare or need your car fixed, all these kinds of things. So not only to to get work full time, part time, not only get job training uh, for free, uh, it's financial uh, programs for living expenses. See, they come up with those all the time because they're always trying to get people, you know, uh, it, uh, cleared away to get a job. Okay, now here's another thing. If you're like 55 or more, the area office on aging. Now, this is another where one-on-one -on -one help. And by the way, all the last one, the career one stop, you make an appointment to see these people. 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 Make an appointment. <laughs> that's the only way you really get the best out of anybody, okay? Uh, and that's what you, the same way, area and office on aging. Uh, so it's called the elder care locator. And here's the link there. We have an 800 number. We do it a lot by phone. So that's someone you could call up one-on-one -on -one, uh, and, and they help. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, you need a new roof? Oh, well, maybe. Hey, here. here. They answer questions like this every day, you know, and, and they're local. They know all this stuff. Okay, so that's it. Now, remember, even though people say they, there isn't or whatever, you can't believe that, okay? <laughs> that's just what they know. Everybody, we all have our areas of expertise. We can't know everything. And, and the people really get things done is when people say it can't be done, you keep going, man. You have to, you have to, you have to in this world, okay? So that's the area office on aging, okay? And that's free one-on-one -on -one help uh, to get money and help what you need, okay? Now, here's another place, is the local community action agency. Okay, every county has them, and this is helping for people with low to medium income to make sure they know all about the programs. Hey, sounds like you, right? Okay, well, they have uh, caseworkers and things like that to help people, individual, one-on-one, -on -one, and things like that. So that's what you do. You call up, make an appointment. Hey, who could I talk to? Who could I make an appointment with? You want to talk because you don't know how to do all this shit, right? <laughs> And so you need to talk to somebody because otherwise you're faking it, you know, and you don't want to fake it. So you and, and shows you how. Now, this link is a listing of all the offices all over the country. And you just put in your zip code or whatever they ask for. And, and uh, uh, they show you the office. Then you call them and say, hey, can I make an appointment and see somebody? I'm screwed. And I don't know what the hell I'm doing. That's it. You don't have to know what to say, what to do. Just admit where the hell you are. People want to help people, if you're honest. Yeah. Uh, and, and and just say you need help. Don't say you need money. Don't say you need what. I, I have a problem. I need help. That's all you have to say. Okay. The next one is uh, uh, really if, if you want making money at home <coughs> or you want to start a business and, and have any kind of problem with that. Well, these are offices, again, in every county. Uh, they have them paid by the government. They can make my money. I can't afford to do this kind of stuff. They do one-on-one -on -one help uh, to help you with your business, work at home, freelance, want to start a nonprofit, want to grow your business. You're an inventor. You're a gig worker. You're an artist. Yeah, okay. This link here shows you a local office and how to make an appointment. Wow, what could be easier than that? Now, that saves you no matter how many hours going around in circles on Google and getting bupkis, <laughs> right? Nothing. And my two favorite places, too, uh, down here, number seven, is 211 and find help. Okay, you you Google them. You could put in you, you, you need home repair, you need a rent money, whatever, and you find all the offices in your area that do that now. This is where you get on the phone. When you get that list of people, you start calling them and say, hey, you help people with rent. Hey, you help people. I, I have problems. Can you help me? That's what you do. You start the conversation with something like that. And, and then they say, nah, what do you think we are? <laughs> Santa Claus? No. And then you say, uh, well, do you know anybody else that may help me? 
Oh yeah, you know, Mabel was telling me about a group she's working with now. Yeah, why don't you try over? Yeah, you know, that's how you get it. Yeah, you know? and that's why get off of that internet and get on the phone. And these are the people even who we'll meet with you. It's a meetup, a meetup for people who need money. <laughs> now that's pretty cool lately. So there's always a way around anything. Start using it. And those of you that think everything's on the internet, you're wrong, you're wrong. The good stuff is when you get on the phone. <laughs> Cause you don't know what the heck this stuff means. <laughs> you're guessing. So get on the phone so you can talk to somebody, grab them by the call and say, hey, what the hell does this really mean? Can I really do this? Can I really? That's how you win in this like game. Okay, so we're at letsgohelp.com and we help people <laughs> apply to every government grant in America. Yeah, uh, that's right. We give unlimited personal help. It's personal help is not like this. It's not one on one, sit down for dinner. <laughs> we do it online and messaging and things like that. Uh, so these are better than us because we only charge 20 bucks. <laughs> They're getting millions from the government to do this. <laughs> so use them. Okay. <laughs> and uh, uh, we also have a report called Let's Go Reports, where we have, you could download lists of uh, offices in your state that specializing in solving your problem whether it's a housing problem, whether it's a legal problem, a healthcare problem, um, you know, even uh, starting a business problem or bills problem or anything like that. We have broke down the kind of problems. And these are all the offices in your state to start calling and, and, and get help with that problem. Okay. And that's lescoreports.com. So you got Lesco Help gives you uh, unlimited personal help <laughs> to apply for every grant. Plus our $30,000 a month private grant. We have a private grant we give out uh, to only members and we give out $30,000 a month now. I mean, that's cool. I mean, I'm really proud we're doing that. And so the the, the uh, uh, profits we make go back to the customers, uh, our members, uh, and we give out grants about 50 a month, everything. So you could apply for that, but you have to be a member. Okay. Good luck.